much energy in this. It would be unwise to keep the Supreme Kai waiting. Right. Uh, this guy's kind of scary. Have you accomplished all that you needed to? Ready to travel to the land of the Kais? Yes, I'm ready to leave. I'm very glad to hear that, Trunks. So, uh, how do we get to the land of the Kais? Kabito here will be taking us to the sacred land. Now then, Kabito, if you would be so kind. Supreme Kai, I must admit that I'm uneasy about letting a mortal step foot in such a sacred place. But if you command it... I'm getting the feeling this guy doesn't like me. Now, stand by my side. Uh, okay. Okay, we're off. Kai Kai! What? Is this... instant transmission? Indeed, it's a special technique of Kabito's. Welcome to the sacred land of the Kai's, Trunks. So... This is the land of the Kais. It kind of looks like Earth. This place is a holy world which not only mortals, but even the Kais and other gods themselves are not permitted to enter. You should feel honored. Oh, I see. Hmm. That mortal outfit of yours does a disservice to this esteemed world. Huh? Wow. It suits you, Trunks. Uh, you really think so? <laughs> it's kind of hard to move in this. Now then, allow me to once again explain why we've asked you to come here. As I mentioned to you back on Earth, we will have you learn to wield the legendary sword of this land. 
That is none other than the Z-Sword, a legendary weapon that has never been wielded before. You mean, no one's ever used it before? Then how am I supposed to learn to use it? First, let's have you take a look at what we're talking about. Follow me. This blade thrust into the ground here is the Z-Sword. To the best of my knowledge, no one has been able to remove the blade from its rocky prison. Okay, so that's what you meant by never been wielded. So, how will this sword help us once it's out? Is its blade extremely sharp or something? Legends say you will be imbued with immense power. Perhaps even enough to destroy the infamous Majin Buu. For eons this has remained. Neither I nor countless other Supreme Kais could remove this remarkable sword. So as a mortal, you will most certainly fail. Well, I guess we'll just have to see for ourselves. Hmm. Here it goes. Budge. Hmm. Okay. Let's try this. Huh? Oh my. This is what a Super Saiyan can do? What incredible power you have. How could a mere mortal possess this? It's no use. Several Supreme Kais before you have tried and failed to remove it. There's no chance you could ever succeed. No. He did it! don't believe this. Tell us, Trunks, how does it feel to wield the legendary Z-Sword? I've been fighting with a sword for a long time, but this... this sword doesn't really feel all that special. Is that so? Perhaps if you spend more time with the blade, you can eventually draw out its latent power. Well, he should familiarize himself with the sword in combat. Indeed. Wait, wait, wait a minute. This sword is extremely heavy. Yeah, I don't think I'll be able to fight using this thing. Could we maybe hold off on the training? I need some time to get used to wielding it. What? Such a disrespectful request. Wait, Kabito. Trunks is well within reason to request that much. It might be prudent for him to get comfortable with the blade first. Mm, very well. See to it you do not put off your training for long. Right. Seems Kabito has taken on the role of instructor here. Huh. Wow! I am truly at a loss for words. I never imagined you'd be able to so freely wield the Z-Sword in such a short amount of time. A most impressive feat! It took some effort, but I think I can wield it like any other sword now. Hmm. Supreme Kai, should we perhaps move on to the training at this juncture? I think we can. What do you think, Trunks? So, what exactly are we going to do for the training? Am I just going to spar with you, Kabito? Hmm. That should suffice. Let's begin. Wait, I think I'd like to gauge Trunks' ability and his technique with the Z-Sword. What do you think? What? 
You want to fight me yourself? I, I'm sorry, but you, the Supreme Kai, intend to fight? It'll be fine. In fact, I'm quite looking forward to the fight. After all, we'll get to learn more about Trunks and the Z-Sword itself. Understood. If that's how you feel, then it would be an honor to fight you. Now, please don't hold anything back. Okay. Time to put this Z-Sword to the test. Here I come! I want to properly gauge your power. Just as I envisioned. This power is incredible! There's still more where that came from. Just you wait! Feels like forever since I fought with a sword. I think you're doing quite well. Incredible! Now it's my turn! Oh no! Your power and abilities far exceed anything we could have imagined. I'm confident our decision to choose you was the right one, Trunks. Uh, thank you. But I still don't feel much power coming from the sword. Hmm, perhaps you still need more practice. Hopefully something will change if we give it more time. Trunks, your training is showing results. You, the wielder of the Z-Sword, should have what it takes to draw out the blade's power. Uh, right. I'll do what I can. Actually, given what I was able to glean from our sparring match, it seems we aren't suitable training partners for you. We've underestimated you. In a good way, someone of your caliber deserves stronger opponents. That means a lot, coming from someone like you. You'll no doubt get much more out of your training if you're up against someone much stronger. Uh, yeah. I guess you're right. Hmm. As it stands now, there is no one in this land any stronger than we are. If fighting with us is not sufficient for your purposes, then you will have to train within your own mind. There, you should be able to conjure any sort of powerful opponent and reflect on their technique. However, that sort of exercise has its limits. Okay. Hmm. That's it. That's exactly it, Kabito. Huh? What? What do you mean? I'll peer into your mind, then take whomever you envision and project them back more clearly into your mind. If all goes well, it should appear as though that person is actually right in front of you. Wow. That's amazing. A wonderful idea, Supreme Kai. You've outdone yourself again. Well, shall we get started then? Just go ahead and imagine someone with whom you'd like to spar. A 
A training partner, huh? Someone really strong would be the most effective for improving as a fighter. So, have you thought of a good training partner? I can't really think of anyone right now. Not a problem. If someone happens to come to mind, just let me know. So, have you thought of a good training partner? Yes, I'm ready. The strong person I'd like to fight is... him. Wow! It's Gohan! It's really him! Now then, Trunks, try to remember how this person fought and spar with him. Sure, I'll see what I can do. Incredible! He's just as powerful as he was when I saw him fight back then! your training session was much more productive than when you fought me. Kabito and I weren't able to draw out any of the power you just displayed. Oh, no problem. You were a big help, Supreme Kai. I wouldn't have been able to spar with Gohan like that if it wasn't for you. This Gohan you imagined, he appeared to be a child. What sort of person was he exactly? In this world, he was my master. But in another world, he was the one who saved Earth. Unfortunately, the Gohan in this world has long since passed away. If it weren't for him, I wouldn't be here, and our world would still be in turmoil. I want to be strong like him. In fact, I need to be even stronger than he was. I see. While it is certainly a shame that Gohan can't be here with us, I'm grateful we have you as this world's next savior. We know the entire universe are counting on you. You're our last hope. Last hope? <laughs> what a strange coincidence. Gohan actually said the same thing to me before he died. Oh, it's no coincidence. Gohan was right to place his faith in you, and I will do the same, Trunks. Well done, Trunks. It seems you've truly mastered your technique with the Z-Sword. Thanks to you, Supreme Kai. I wouldn't have been able to make this much progress on my own. Seriously. If I'm being honest, though, I feel like I've really only gotten an arm workout out of this. 
to think that the first to properly wield the Z-Sword would be nothing more than a simple mortal. How strange. Now then, Trunks, let's finish up your training. This here is Kachin, said to be the hardest metal in the universe. Go ahead and try to slice it with the Z-Sword. You got it. Okay, throw it when you're ready. Supreme Kai, it's Babidi. It has started. He's begun to make a move on Earth. What? The time has finally come. Let's make our way back to Earth, Trunks. As long as you have the Z-Sword, you should be able to stop Majin Buu's revival. Right. Uh, oh. Um, could you give me my old clothes back before we leave? I think you look quite nice in those, but very well. Kabito, if you would. As you wish, Supreme Kai. Thank you very much. I feel more like myself in these clothes. Hm. Now then, to Earth. Kai Kai! this evil energy this power it's unbelievable is this Majin Buu's energy no Majin Buu hasn't been released yet this energy most likely belongs to Babidi and his minions but it's only a matter of time before they release Majin Buu we have to stop them before they can do that Never felt energy this wicked. We have to stop Babidi and his minions. Okay, they look pretty weak. Yes! I can sense a great evil energy. This is nothing like when I fought the androids. Okay, they look pretty weak.
Pretty weak. Is that is that Bobbity? <laughs> Those, no, neither of them are Bobbity. <laughs> Company. <laughs> There is absolutely no way we're letting you get past the two of us! Be on your guard. Both of them are under the control of Bobbity's mind magic. What? Supreme Kai, that creature, is that? The demon beast Yakon. I can't believe Bobbity has that kind of creature on his side. Demon beast Yakon? That's right. He's an unbelievably powerful creature, feared the universe over. As I mentioned before, Bobbity uses his magic to control and assemble strong fighters. They're very dangerous. Okay, understood. Don't worry, Supreme Kai. I'll take care of them on my own. With the training I've received from you, as well as the power of the Z-Sword, I should be able to defeat them. The Trunks, wait! If I can't manage to take care of these two, I can't expect to survive the fight ahead. Oh, and also... I'm itching to put all of that training to the test. Supreme Kai. I understand. We'll place our trust in you, Trunks. Look at this. You want to take us on all by your lonesome? We're Lord Bobbity's elite, you know. You're in real trouble now. <laughs> I'll cut you to pieces. Let's do this. First, I'm going to defeat you two, and then I'm going to take out Bobbity. <laughs> what an idiot! We are going to beat us! You surrender, and allow me to do Sorry, I'm not looking to be anyone's lunch. This is a trap! I would have no problem in the dark! Got you, you did it! Now on to Bobbity. Just now. I can see them both going down. There's no way you can beat me. This is what Bobby's going to do. That's useless. 
Then why not give it up already? Here! Take this! <laughs> what? What's so funny? <laughs> you idiot. As we speak, Lord Bobbity's already reviving Martian Boo. What? What? What do you mean? <laughs> you done for <laughs> what? Hmm? Supreme Kai, I can sense a wicked energy in another location. How did we not notice it before? These two, they increase their own evil energy to distract us. No, they intended to stall us and we fell right into their trap. Be that as it may, I don't sense Manjin Buu's energy, so we still have time. Let's get going! The wicked energy is coming from over there! Hurry, Trunks! Ah, this is bad. I can't believe they were just a diversion! Ah! Yet! I hope we make it, we have to! Damn that Bobbity, where is he? Get! Okay, they look pretty weak. What a strange energy. Is it him? So, you finally found me. Bobbity. Wait, that small creature is the wizard Bobbity? Then who's the larger guy with him? Deborah, what is the king of the demon realm doing here? The worms all seem to have gathered. <laughs> Tabora, this guy, he feels way stronger than Perfect Cell. My apologies, Trunks. I wasn't aware Bobbity ensnared such a powerful foe. We, we should be okay for now. Majin Buu hasn't been released yet. There is still hope left. Indeed. I seem to require just a bit more energy to bring Boo into this world. No matter, though. I will be gathering that energy now. <laughs> Not if I have anything to say about it. Oh, my. Well, I suspected you would try to stop me. Deborah, what should we do about these pests, hmm? I can think of no better way to celebrate Bajin Buu's revival than to destroy them gloriously with my demonic power. <laughs> Lovely! Have at it then, and make it extra flashy! Yes, my lord. <laughs> I'll store the energy produced from the damage you take from Deborah to help revive Majin Buu! <laughs> And it's only a matter of time before I have enough to release him. At full power! This is not good. If we take too much damage, we'll only further contribute to Majin Buu's revival. Then that means we just need to take this guy out fast and prevent Bobbity from gathering enough energy. Hmm. I suppose that's true, but... We have no other choice if we want to stop Majin Buu from being released. 
worry Deborah might be a bit more than you can handle. I'll assist you as best I can. Supreme Kai, if you will fight, then so will I. Capito, it might be better if you stood by for now. Yes, Supreme Kai, as you command. Ready for this, Trunks? Yes. <laughs> Do you honestly think you can win? You're nothing but fools. I'll eradicate you in an instant. Slaughter them, Deborah. Yes. His energy is overwhelming, but I can't let it intimidate me. I have to do this for Earth. I don't care you're the king of some evil world. I'm going to stop you. <laughs> Allow me to at least commend your spirit. For mercy, Devor! Devor is far more dangerous! Watch yourself! You possess a respectable amount of strength to push me this far. We have to stop you! Ah! Impossible! <laughs> Starts now. I'm going to persevere. I'm gonna beat you. Or to a demon king's power. Drop the sword! It's going to turn to stone! <laughs> no! Not the Z sword! <laughs> the Supreme Kai and his fools are done for! Hooray! Hooray! Martin Boo is as good as revived! I won't allow that to happen! Even if it costs me my life! <laughs> Tabura! <laughs> Supreme Guy! No! You of all people must not die! Kibito! Oh. Mm. <laughs> You'll meet your friend in death soon enough. <laughs> Trunks! Trunks! You have to do this! You're... This world's last... Oh. <laughs> Only you can do this. You're this world's next savior. If anyone's gonna bring peace, it's you. You're our last... Hope. Obtained. I won't let you take that away from us! You two, you two are gonna pay! What is this? It seems anger triggers a big piece of his power. He still does 
Supreme Kai! No! Supreme Kai! <laughs> and so the fight ended. Though he had lost the Supreme Kai and Kabito, Trunks could finally breathe a sigh of relief. Earth was at peace once more. No more would androids, Cell, or the fear of Majin Buu threaten the people of the planet. Towns and cities would prosper, and people would carry smiles on their faces, unaware of the sacrifices made by the warriors who fought to defend their lives. But such knowledge is not their burden to bear. Trunks will ensure it never will be as he continues to fight for peace. Supreme Kai, Kibito, thank you for everything. Go on. I promise. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this world.
Hope's last defender remains ever vigilant. The city's looking more like its old self. <laughs> huh? Right. Understood. Thanks.
Yeah. Right. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing this for poor. Need to bring back that person's sister. Understood. Wow! See ya. Let's see. What? <laughs> yeah. Yeah! 
Nope. What? Um... Excuse me! Right... Give me a break. Ha <laughs> ha! 